this a Friday in August? We've long urged all governments, uh, all people, not to cooperate uh, in military ways, not to engage in any military cooperation with countries like North Korea, pose a threat to U.S. national security interests. Um, I would say that since September 11th, we've had um, a lot of uh, you know, support uh, around the world very different relationship with many of the countries on whom North Korea has traditionally re relied for, for technology, economic support, and diplomatic support. Uh, and those relationships are important to us, and we have always, uh, I think, urged people not to cooperate in military ways. Sure. Oh, um, can you talk a bit about uh, the meetings that... Uh, the talks they've had in Beijing have been very useful and productive. Uh, we've had a long history of cooperation with China on Korean Peninsula issues on both sides intend to continue that. We think the Chinese government shares our concern about the possible introduction of nuclear weapons into the Korean Peninsula. We hope to proceed on the basis of that shared concerns and we will continue our consultations with China. These people don't value life, and they hijack a great religion and murder in the name of that religion. They just did that recently in Indonesia. And we'll be joining our friends in Australia in a, a day of mourning for the terrible tragedy that took place. We lost lives. They lost a lot of lives. Listen, these are killers. Nothing but cold-blooded killers. We're going to treat them that way, and we're going to hunt them down one person at a time. <laughs> 